fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 18th of October 2024. I hope you are keeping well. I've decided to come back for a supplementary game at bedtime. and I'm going to play the uh, New York Times medium level puzzle again because I was thinking actually, you know, some people actually might prefer medium level games. Uh, I know that I, the thing is in the comments section, usually we get some people who are very good at Sudoku expressing their rapid times which is great stuff well done um, I'm happy and pleased to see those comments but uh, um, a lot of people are actually less uh, or have less experience at Sudoku and might prefer the, the easier type games and so I think the uh, medium level puzzle is one that is tough enough as Ed Balls might was it Ed Balls? No, not Ed Bowles, uh, the other British politician who, <laughs> I can't remember who it was, I can't remember his name now, but somebody who couldn't say tough enough. <laughs> One who couldn't eat a bacon sandwich, I've forgotten his name, but anyway. Um, <laughs> it's tough enough uh, for many people. And uh, anyway, I'll get on with that in just a second. Before I give you some good news, the Texas Supreme Court has stopped the execution of uh, Robert Robin Robertson, I should say, uh, somebody I mentioned the other week, who has been scheduled for execution, despite being convicted on junk science, uh, and to, just to you know reiterate how bloodthirsty these people are in Texas, uh, he actually had the, the remember the 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 people who were t asking to stop the execution were the prosecutors because they said no it's unsafe but yeah, the court um continued to uh, um, um go forward with the execution um and uh the texas the, the court in texas actually blocked the execution on thursday and then the Tex texas court of criminal appeals overturned that ruling and said go ahead with it um, but uh, finally, the Supreme Court has uh, issued an injunction just a couple of hours before he was due to uh, be murdered, let's say, state murdered, because that's what execution is, really. It's a, it's state murdering a human being. Uh, of course, all capital punishment should be stopped everywhere, but in particular, this one is, 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 is we're all glad that this one has been stopped because his conviction was based on junk science. Uh, and he has maintained his innocence throughout th as well. All right, let's get on with this New York Times medium level puzzle. Then I'm going to start with sevens blocking up like this and give myself a nice little seven in that square there. We've got sevens going across here, across here, and up there. So there will also be a seven in that square. <clears throat> Uh, we have eight going across this way and this way. <coughs> Excuse me. Eight blocking up here. There's an eight. And we have four blocking this square and this square in the top row. All the actions at the top here. Uh, missing numbers are one and six. We've got six blocking that square. So six will be over here. And one will be in this square here. Uh, we have eight across here, across there, and down, and down there. We have eight down, up, across, and across for an eight in this square. That's the final digit, eight. Chinese people believe eight is a lucky number. And uh, you can often see um, number plates here in Thailand that belong to, let's say, Chinese uh, people with Chinese ancestry, at least, and in some cases, actually Chinese people, uh, with a number plate eight, eight, with, with plenty of eights in. Sometimes we have up to four digits in our number plates here, and sometimes you get eight, 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 and uh, those are super expensive number plates to buy. <coughs> Seems pretty unlucky to me that you would spend all your money on a number plate, but then again, those people are so rich they don't care anyway. 
Uh, we've got nine blocking up here and nine across there. That's going to put nine into this square here. Nine this way, this way, down and around. Oh, I'm feeling seasick. Uh, no, we haven't finished. Ah, there's another one to grab over here. I was about to say we're done, but we are done now. Okay. We have seven across here and across here and down there. Six blocking down here puts a six into that square. One blocks this square, and this one up here blocks that square. So in that column, that's the only place for a one. Uh, one blocking up here puts one into one of these two squares. So what do we know? We know that along here we can't have a one and we also have this one blocking across here. So only one gap left in that first column. One has to be there. Two then blocks this square here. So two must be at the bottom here and we go back up and fill it in with a five, this last digit here. Then we have five blocking across here and up here like that. There's our five. Three is what we need to finish this column. Three blocks across here and down here. Good practice for scanning this is, I think. Three blocks across here. Now three, where is three in this block here? Either here or here, blocking up meaning that's a three, then three across here, three across here. For those of you who are still kind of beginners at Sudoku, this kind of stuff is good practice, I think. Two there, two blocking across here. There's a two. One blocking across here puts one into this square here. Six blocks this square. We don't have six in this column yet. Let's put it there. Put it there, pal. This is a four to finish the uh, column. And we've done quite a lot already, haven't we? Uh, missing numbers here are one and four, so this is not one or four. It's whatever is left in this row, which is a three. Three blocking all the way to the bottom here and across there gives us three in that square, three across this way, this way, and down here. 3, 8 and 9 are now completed. We have one blocking across here and here, so there's our 1, 1 going up here says this is a 1 and the last number to get here is 4. 4 down here, 4 across here, 4 across there, there's our 4. 4 across here and 4 down there, there's another 4. Five blocks down here, that puts five into this square. The last numbers to get here are two and six. Uh, don't think I can see where they go at the moment. I also know that that square there must be two or six, right? Work that out. You know, if we only have two missing from here and two across here, they have to be the same number. But I can't say which is which just yet. <coughs> Okay, let's see what we still need to do. We need ones. Uh, what do we know about ones? They're left in those squares there. We need twos, and what do we know about the twos? We've got a pair of twos there and there. Ah, now we've got two blocking down here and two across there, so we can say that must be a two. All right, let's move on to fours. Threes are finished already. 
Uh, what do we know about fours? We've got a couple of fours down here and up there. What ha what's happening with the fives? Now five blocks across here, so that means in this column down here, which doesn't yet have a five, we know the five has to go there. We also know the missing digit uh, in this column is six, I think. And we also need a six to finish this block here. Uh, what's still left to get here is five and seven. Do we have any clue? Well, we're about to because we've got one number missing for this block or this column, which is a seven. So when a seven blocks across here, we know that that's our seven, that's our five. And for this row, we are lacking six, I think. Six blocks down here and across there. That gives us six in that square. The missing numbers here are four and five. So this is not four or five. It has to be a two. Two blocks across here. There's our two. And the last number over here is six. Uh, right, what else? Let's see what we've got up here. We've got a seven here. So seven blocking down and seven across there will give us seven in that square. Now there's one number missing for this row, which is one. One blocks up there. That gives me the one there and that's finished. Missing number here looks to be a four to me. Four blocks to the bottom and here's a four. And this will be a five five blocking up here there's a five and we finish with two so a nice relaxing puzzle medium level puzzle from the new york times uh, and uh, i'll see you over the weekend for lots of sudoku because i haven't got too much to do take care bye, -bye.